What's happening, everybody? Jeff Lightsey Jr. with the Ball Sports Network. Thank you guys for the continued support. Now, I recently did a video about how Tom Brady is basically laughing about what's going on in New England. Brady got his sixth win. His team is 6-2. and two. The Patriots are 2-5. and five. Brady's enjoying football. The Patriots are on a four-game losing streak. They look miserable. Brady is doing everything possible to make Tampa a winner while the Patriots are working in reverse, right? So, uh, there's a lot of like of factors on why Brady is laughing at the Patriots. Make sure you guys hit the thumbs up button notification like subscribe all that good stuff now here's the thing bill belichick has now come out and said hey you know okay we're struggling you know we we're cap strapped right we sold out for the last five years and we won three super bowls we made it to a fourth and we lost in the afc championship game so that's a hell of a five I mean, that's that five-year stretch is more than 90% of the league, right? Like, that five-year stretch is more than what 90% of the league has done in the history of their organization. So I get that. But but don't make any excuses now, Bill. Brady is the reason why this team is horrible. Brady being gone. Because if Tom Brady was on this team, he would be making, uh, he would be making chicken salad out of chicken you-know-what. Brady. But see, to me, I saw that as a shot at Brady. He's like, hey, you guys are giving Tom all this credit, and they have a lot of weapons, and they're having a lot of success over in Tampa. But we just won three Super Bowls in five years. We also went to another one and then went uh, to the AFC Championship game. So, yeah, we're cash-strapped. We had eight guys opt out, and we're not doing that great. But I think in, in, all, <laughs> in, in saying everything, to me, he's saying it ain't because of Tom Brady while we're losing. We're losing because we sold out over the last five years, which is true. But the truth is, you guys are losing because Tom Brady isn't there. <laughs> and Tom Brady left because you didn't help him out. You didn't get him any offensive weapons. Think about the offensive players on, on New England. They drafted Nikhil Harry in the first round a couple years ago, and he looks like a bust. Edelman it leads the league in drops, and he's hurt all the time. He's, a, he's washed up. You got James White. That's it. Sony Michelle, for some reason, isn't good anymore. I don't know what the hell happened with Sony Michelle during the during the Super Bowl year, the year they beat the Rams. Sony Michelle looked like he was going to be an all world. And now he can't seem to play. He don't even play anymore. So Sony Michelle doesn't play. James White's your only legit offensive weapon. They drafted two tight ends in this past draft, and them boys got 10 catches for the whole season. We're eight games into this thing. We're seven, eight games into this season. We got 10 catches between two players? Yeah. Brady. But somehow, some way, Tom Brady, if he was on that team, they wouldn't be two and five. They'd probably be five and two. <laughs> that team. That horrible team. Then this is no shot at Cam. He just ain't Tom Brady. This is no shot at Cam. He just isn't Tom Brady. He looked really good. They won their first game against the Dolphins. And then he looked really good against the Seahawks. When we come to find out, Seattle might have the worst defense in the NFL. <laughs> like, they're down there. It's like the Jets, the Cowboys, and the Seahawks. Seahawks the only winning team out of that list. But they have one of the worst defenses, especially pass defenses, in the NFL. They can't rush the passer. They can't cover anybody. They just have Russell Wilson, who's amazing. So, I think Bill Belichick took some shots at Brady. But, nah, man. I ain't letting you slide with that. You saying we sold out the last five years and we won three Super Bowls? That is true. But you guys are struggling this year because 12's in Tampa and not in Foxborough. That's the ultimate. That's the truth. You can take your shots, subliminal or whatever, throughout the media. And people ain't reporting it like that, but that's how I see it. it took some subliminal shots at 12, but guess what? 12's laughing all the way to the bank and might laugh all the way to the Super Bowl. Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Once again, I'm Jeff Lightsey Jr. with the Ball Sports Network. I'll see you next time.